it's nice to be here. Well, the public has a right to know. It's where you have to balance between whether the public has a right to know and whether it's going to be an invasion of someone's privacy. Bring up a very good point. A wedding is a time for a family come together, a celebration of joy, and a wonderful event, a, a memorable event of, in a woman's life. And here they are spending hundreds of thousands of dollars having this beautiful wedding, and then all of a sudden they tell them, oh no, you can't do this, you have to move, you have to go. But your way, according to this class action lawsuit, the people are not having it their way mm. at all. They're getting a small, small burger. So they're basically saying, and according to the class action lawsuit, which is brought by a class uh, representative who represents people who are similarly situated in the class, people who go to Burger King and purchase this Whopper of a burger, but they're saying it's deceptive in their lawsuit that, in fact, Dunkin' Donut infringed on their copyright. And plaintiffs have the burden of proof, and so they have to prove first off that there was a copyright, and plaintiffs claim that their slogan, trademark, is copyrighted. Right. You have to be careful because when you tell someone not to do something, a lot of times who will say, oh, then I should pay attention to all those people outside. I'm hopeful that maybe the jurors are brought in a different way so they don't see the people outside, so they're not exposed to that, people cheering for Johnny or signs or anything like that. Think about this type of case and think about what exactly is happening. The Department of Agriculture has come out and said that you should not feed ducks, that it actually harms the ducks itself to actually feed them human food. The key to this case is going to be the HOA documents. What exactly are the restrictions on the HOA documents. Ultimately, you'll be up to the court to make a determination, but as I stated before, the HOA documents are key, and we'll have to see what happens with this duck situation. The end of wrapping up, of showing the jurors, listen, you had this person testify, and they help establish this, and they help establish the, the different elements that they want to bring forth for the defamation, and that we've proved our case. So I think that's, that's key for the attorneys to do that and try and not let that outside noise affect them.